everyone around here seems to be very in touch with nature. Death. <laughs> he doesn't have a face. Nope. I thought everyone had a face. Hello. Are you familiar with the music of Robert Smith? Who? Oh? Don't worry. I was just thinking about something. How can I help you? Are you the one I need to talk to about getting to where I can talk to someone else about meeting with management? That was hard to remember. Yes. Yes, I am the one you seek. Yes, management indeed lies beyond this river. Great. Can you take me across then? Certainly. It would not be any trouble at all. Okay. What do I have to do? Simply climb aboard my vessel and I will take you there. As simple as that, eh? All right. Well, I'll just climb aboard then and we'll be on... Unless... You do not possess your travel coin. My travel coin? Passage is granted only to souls who bear the coin of life. Be gone with you, human soul. Well, I never... <laughs> Don't go. It gets lonely here in the night times. Okay. Where was I supposed to get a coin? I haven't seen anything like that. You don't get a coin. You die with one. Unless you've sold or lost it, then you should have one. Now, be gone, human. Will you let me cross without a coin? Pretty please. No soul may pass who does not bear the coin of life. The change of liberty. <laughs> the shrapnel of the mortal coil. The... I get the picture. Can we talk about something else? Certainly. Has a man named Albert passed through here? Yes, there have been many Alberts. <laughs> I'm sure he must have come this way at some... Looks like I'll have to get across somehow. Does this lavish garden belong to you? Yes, I enjoy plants. They remind me of life. There hasn't been much going on around here lately, and I thought... You know what? You deserve it. So I took up gardening. <laughs> Do you know how rare it is to find flowers in Mimbo? I have some idea. It's a total ball lake. <laughs> okay, that's enough about your gardening. Goodbye. Stay where you are. I'll be back. <laughs> Let's see if we can find this damn coin. I could ask Norm about this, but I get the feeling it wouldn't help. But you, you think Norm would you need, Doris? know why I don't have a coin? And no, we're not going to talk about see it. Later. See you soon, Doris. I could rummage around in this bush all day, but I don't <laughs> really know what I'd be looking for. Okay, then. Nothing new over here? <sighs> I swear, God. I could ask Norm about this, but I get the feeling it wouldn't help. What can I ask Norm about? I could ask Norm about this. So, no new information, yet again. She seems agitated. But she's not supposed to be agitated. Hi there. Are you two- Oh yes, better than ever now, thanks. I wonder why. You two didn't happen to see me drop a coin around here, did you? No, I can't say I did. You may have dropped it when you first came to Limbo. Yes, that does happen sometimes. People are all in a rush to see what the afterlife is all about. They'd forget to take their ears if they weren't screwed on. Your ears are screwed on, aren't they? <laughs> no. And I'll bear the advice in mind. Thanks. Alright. Let's go back to the portal. Alright, maybe he knows where my coin is. Alright. That's so purple. I don't know what's purple. I'm not going to throw my stuff over a cliff. It's the demon I got Norb to push off the cliff. He doesn't. 
I could put this in here and see if it floats away. But what if I never get it back? <laughs> um... I might need my glasses for this. No! It says, I wonder what that means. There's nothing else. I wonder why you could possibly be here again. Perhaps you could cross the river you so desperately wanted to cross. Because you cross me. You have my coin, don't you? That's right, old lady. This coin. This coin is mine. This sounds like extortion. What is it you want then? I'm glad you asked. I want the transmitter device. I need some uh, transitional support. You just want to mess with North, <laughs> don't you? So what if I do? You're not in a position to argue. You can't go anywhere without this coin. You'd better give that back to me. Oh, what? Oh, um, why would you do this to a this <laughs> old lady? Nice try! I will smite you, demon. <laughs> hey, it's my only choice. I've had enough of you. Charge! That's ingrate. I can't oh. believe he ate me. This cretin is going down. Hmm, it's bigger on the inside. Oh my gosh. I just love her reactions to everything. Best find yet. The narration is just priceless. A nasty pool of gut goop. I don't know the technical term. I'm not putting my hand in there without some kind of protection. I'm talking latex. <laughs> yes. It's all gross. Ooh, what's that? Just what I always wanted. A single marigold. How <laughs> useful. Okay. Hey. You would think that would work. But I have no reason to put a glove on this skeleton arm. Okay. Huh? Okay, Doris. I can't reach that from here. Maybe I need Walked to all the way back. Okay. That's true. That's right, buddy. You did. What now? What's happening? That's right, buddy. You did. Okay, what am I doing? Oh, gosh. What am I doing? Together. Okay, so I have to figure out... Wait. I could ask Norb about this. Why can't I get Norb's help on any of this? Everything I'm stuck on. Why would a specific tune help me in this? Sphincter shaved hole. I don't know what will happen if I touch it again. Besides, I don't think I'm getting back out that way. I can believe Not that. that. Either way is particularly preferable. So. Well, I suppose I'm putting my hand into whatever this is. Wish me luck. <laughs> A music box. Okay. I think I'm getting an idea. I don't think I can do anything with this. Other than listen to it. Oh, uh, listen to it. A little wooden music box. I wonder what it sounds like. Okay. 
So we'll see if I can do that. This might take me a minute, so I'll be back. That's right, buddy. You did. is happening. Uh-oh. Alright. <clears throat> well, that got him. Didn't anyone ever teach you to respect your elders? Okay. So he hits classical, is the achievement that I just got. And I think that's all the time that I have to play that, because that also got me stuck. And that drove me nuts. <laughs> I think that would have been easier if I had any musical talent whatsoever, but I don't. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching. It's been Danny Murray with Marlon May playing The Tale of Doris and the Dragon, and you have a great night. Thanks.